Hello, everybody. Welcome back to another wonderful day of Charlemagne's adventure in No Man's Sky. I should actually say hello, fellow adventurers. Welcome back. But yeah, nah. Next time, next episode, no big deal. Let's so make sure you grab your drinks and tasty treats, and let's get this started. So where are we? Well, I found an awesome place here to build a base. This is where we're going to build our base, right here. And I'm not sure how I'm going to utilize this area back here, but ah. Uh. So when you first load the game, you kind of get stuttering issues and whatnot, but that, that goes away. It's probably because I have it on a hard drive instead of the... Uh, instead of the solid state drive that I have. So, yes. So the plan here is basically to utilize this hillside here. This is where I'm going to create my entrance for the vehicles is right here. So then we can just drive up basically, I think from either side of this thing here. Yeah, maybe we might have to do some terraforming. I don't know, maybe. <laughs> but the plan is to build kind of like an outpost here. Just uh, the reason I built it here is because there's the storm crystals that can appear on this on this planet so in the frost area here there's something called storm crystals and you can harvest those and they're worth a ton of money so that is good there is i think an out um so this is important too to have because it's like a components uh, the outpost or whatever technology merchant and i'll show you why it's because of this stuff here so even though they don't sell very many at least you can buy components here every time you show up so if I knew I needed you know salt refractors for something I could buy these and yeah so I can do that <laughs> I have very severe uh, inventory issues <laughs> so I can't really do anything on that front uh, let's see here right here yeah you can see just severe inventory issues that's my problem with this game <laughs> and it's only because I can't access my base I can it's just pain in the butt right now it's just it's easier when you have your bases set up and you have the teleporters between them um, yeah so let's run over now there is there is um, another marker that was placed I only came here just because I wanted to to experiment. I came here in my little spaceship because I wanted to explore. It took me here on uh, one of the uh, the Quicksilver missions. So yeah, and so this is how I ended up putting a save point here. I don't have my freighter here. My freighter is in a different system. <laughs> All right, so let's take a peek. Uh, yes. Okay, let's get out of this Atlas Free Explorer. There we go. Going to deselect current system. Okay. So this is where I am. My freighter is up here. Right? And yeah, the, the next Atlas is up here, it looks like. So we're doing quite well. Look at this place back here. So anyhow, I guess these are the little lines, the warp lines that you took or that we take to get to where we are. So anyway, so we're down here now, which is kind of neat. An interesting part of space. Um, so I want to fly back to the freighter. because We have this place kind of uh, bookmarked, but we'll be back, so it's not like it's a big deal. But we'll go to this. We'll go back to this system. So I want to show you. I, I placed a marker in the um, in the multiplayer and I think the marker held so now we're gonna prove it I'd also like to thank in the last videos somebody commented uh, I should have wrote your name down I just yeah uh, I apologize for that but yeah um, I appreciate the comment it's basically about the frigates how we can repair them uh, we can repair the frigates by actually going on them I didn't realize we could go on them <laughs> I don't remember where that was game or if there was a tutorial or anything I completely missed it but yeah see this right here there's oh my god what's going on here everything at once god okay <laughs> oh man so let's go down here this is supposedly I think oh man 
So we have to take care of this business first. Okay, let's get my positron ejector ready. Come on. Yeah, yeah, of course it wants my lubricant. Uh, from where though? Oh, here we go. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah, here we go. Four of them? Woo! What? Ooh. I didn't see that one. Okay, two more ships. I see. I like the new uh, GUI because I can find find them where they are. Where did those guys come from? Woo. Where did those ships come from? They were helping me. What the hell? That's so cool. Oh, okay. I guess, guess. Weird. Where did these guys come from? These fighters. Thank you, dudes. I wonder if they came from my ship. So, anyways, what was I? Yeah, so there's a marker here. So, let's go check the marker out. I don't know if this is the right planet either. I, I think it is, but let's. So that was a distraction. So let's check this plan out. Let's see what is down here. I'm gonna try and cut this video with as, with as little uh, edits again. Cause that's just the way I am. I'm really lazy, unfortunately. Uh, is this the place? Oh, maybe. I think this is it. Yeah, yeah, see? So the multiplayer replaced it. And now here, this is where it is. I was hoping I would still have this place. This should be the component just exactly the same thing except here this is the hot planet <laughs> and this is going to be and the other one's the cold planet so so yeah so this is a Corvax planet just like the other one which I broke the Corvax in I don't know why I just I think I answered the question wrong because I don't know enough of the Corvax words Trinanites for blueprints maybe or I don't know what he would be saying here so I almost have the words um, so let's go purchase components. So same kind of thing. So what I want to do is build a teleporter here so that way we can teleport to the other base if we need to buy more of these. And then we have another base that you can teleport to. And kind of as I progress through the game, I want to build these bases. Uh, yeah, I just, I just go from there. So the next base is focus on farming, which means that I need to to figure out what I'm going to do with that and how it's going to generate me money um, because I spent like 50 million or <laughs> already in units and it's so hard to build up so yeah uh, but definitely you know if there's any tips down below if you're still listening I appreciate uh, that I appreciate you you taking the time to listen to my voice and I will try and do better to reduce the swearing and anything like that because why not not because, you know, I don't like, you know, I like swearing and whatnot. That's not a problem for me, but, you know, I do want to try and reduce it and not do it as often. Have more self-control in that respect. And yeah, we'll see how it goes. You know, if my emotions get high, then that's fine. It just means that it's an intense situation. And, you know, just go with it. You know, I don't have a problem at all with swearing. And, you know, I know other people do, but... <laughs> If you do then you wouldn't be listening to my channel right so anyhow let's let's carry on so this is uh, the reason why i wanted this place is because of this and the hot planet so you can create a base to explore this place nice big flat area here to build in and then there's a couple guest places here so i figure we can take this place over right so let's check the freighter out let's see how we can repair the that one freighter i'm kind of curious now so let's go take off. Oof. This is cool. It's close to a resource there. I just saw right there. There's a resource. Nice. Um, over there, there's a resource, which is fairly close. And up here, there's a resource. So it, it has all that stuff nearby. That's the, the other reason I wanted to build here as well. And then there's this stuff here. Yeah, it's a really good location. It's, I wouldn't say it's perfect, but it has everything that you need. And here we go, up into space we go. Oh, man, this is so amazing, this game, I just love it. Okay, let's go to our space, or 
the freighter there. I want to see kind of... Okay, so let's go. Let's go. Which one of these is broken? I don't know. Uh, undiscovered, really? Oh, yeah. That's not undiscovered. Okay, so one of these ships down here. So this is right side up. It's upside down in the system. So let's see here. So these we can land on? I don't know, man. I don't think so. No. Unless I'm completely misunderstanding. Because it's these bad boys I want to repair, right? One of these is broken. This is probably my fighting ship. Is that where the fighters came out of? Maybe? Oh no, oh! Oh! Never mind, folks, okay. So it's the, the guy who was right. Uh, my bad. Holy crap. Uh, where is it? So, so... So let's land on this one. I don't know if this is the right one. But wow, I didn't even realize that there's a whole... <laughs> wow. Okay, salute. Wow, okay. Um, this is scary, actually. Because can we die in space? Oh, man. Wow, this is so awesome. Oh, thank you. Holy crap. Now, is this how you have to repair stuff? Like, are you serious? I don't even know where to go to repair. So like an inside? Oh, there's the interface? Does that work? No? Okay. Now, if I'm missing something, definitely comment. It is glitchy, though. See? It's not letting me walk. I don't like this. That's, that's scary. Okay. Okay. It's rocket. I'm getting off this ship. This <laughs> it doesn't feel safe. Dang man, that's pretty cool. Wow. Impressive. Okay, so not this ship maybe? Oh man, so this is the fighting one. So what about this one? Is this the one I think? Let's see. Ah, this game. Ah, okay, okay. Damaged. There we go. So this is how we do it. Vessel's failing. Cannot endure long in this state. Help us, traveler. Spec damage report. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you should have told me uh, <laughs> sooner in a different way. Cool. Oh, this is epic, like, it's like a little mini quest. At least this has an inside, so this shouldn't glitch out too badly. Okay, this is so cool. Oh, wow, okay. Oh, this is so cool. <laughs> oh, man, this game just doesn't cease to amaze me. Okay, now where? I can't go that way. Go this way. No. Okay. No, okay. So. Yeah. There's a lot of points actually on here that have to be fixed. Let's see here. Is it up here? like an inside yeah just those markers throw me off so I think it's these three markers in front it's just the way they show up at the top I uh, just gotta ignore kind of how it looks ah uh, there we go so let's fix this down here damage cargo pod 
platinum, platinum, platinum. This is so cool, the animation. Okay, that's done. We we're gonna build a base, but it's turning into a repair the frigate type of. Oh, that's such a cool, cool shot. Look at that. Oh, epic. Amazing. Now, if only the planet you moved rotated, right? Did that kind of stuff. But yeah, that is cool. That's cool. Okay. Engine core. Platinum again? It's, it's getting expensive. Uh, look, it's starting up. Woo! Woo! Nice. Okay, and this is... Okay. So I think once you learn the ships... So I think the other one on top you can repair, maybe. There we go. Okay. Quest complete. Oh, I didn't even know it was a quest <laughs> until you landed. Oh, man. Beautiful. This is so cool. Okay, now back to the frozen world to build. That's plan. Try and ignore these objectives. You know what I mean? I, I did alert Nada, but I'm not sure why it's stuck on this. So maybe because of the community research stuff, this is kind of what's taken over. But I think once this it doesn't happen, then this will continue. But that's just a guess. You can't really reset them. And you can't really get rid of quests, I don't think. Not like I would want to. But yeah, let's grab this stuff. High capacity, high capacity. Nice, that was a good engagement. Okay. Ship repair, nice. I didn't know we could land on these. It's a whole different world. Oh man, it's just... So can we land on this thing? See, so that's the top. Oh yeah, there is right here, right here, right here. Check this ship out, just for. Oh, and this is the. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Nice. Big in the scan. What? What does this do? Huh? Is there like an inside to this place? It's cool. We're gonna find that historical data. It's on that world. So, yeah, sure. Uh, let's check it out. We're deviating. I'm sorry, folks. I'm sorry. But you know how long these episodes are. They're usually about an hour. So, we'll definitely get into the base building. I'm not gonna get into 100% of it. But this is a cool looking ship. Dang. Sweet. <laughs> this is so cool. I wish we could build our own like ships, like build your own frigate, you know, and kind of put your own components on there. That'd be so cool. We need to have like NPCs that you could ha like have on here, milling about as if it's a real ship. But man, I'm amazed at what they've been able to do. So definitely props. Um, and this guy here, there's there's probably a landing pad on him, right? somewhere let's see here yeah yeah okay so yeah so they're all they're all pretty cool ships and then this is this ship okay so let's go check out that historical data here damn yeah yeah no large ships in the range that's so cool I didn't know you could use scanner on it it's just oh man now I don't read up information online. I'm relying on the game to teach me these, all of these skills. Um, but that's why I wanted to do videos because I wanted to see if, if people watch my videos. One, and two, um, and people comment. And so it's great. Sure, it's one guy, but it's fantastic. Guy, girl, or whoever they are, it doesn't matter. So let's see here, ancient ruin. This is cool. You can use this to explore. You scan a spot and okay. Look at it. a place to land here. 
Ugh! Dang! What's that? This is really cool. Okay, what is here? Is it the same situation just on this planet? Oh my goodness. Maybe. Maybe potential building site? Oh yes, look at that. It's another technology merchant. Definitely a spot to remember. <laughs> oh, I'm so glad. Why is that? How is this ancient? Oh yeah, the ancient rune is... That's right, that's right. So did I already place a marker on this world? Or is it the other world? Yeah, it's the other world. Perfect. You, I think you can do one per planet. So that is cool. Let's see here. Let's go... Save beacon so we can so we can uh, place it. Let's see. Sink points. Ah, oh, metal plating. Okay. Plating to these bad boys. Okay. Let's try this again. Bam. Okay. Perfect. So that is that. This is this location marked. Now let's check out. Those ruins. Where are they? We're, I'll just fly over there. It's just easier that way. Perfecto. Just don't change, yo. Ah, uh, it's underground. You know what? I am not gonna bother today. <laughs> I don't want to dig. <laughs> Hopefully, that marker sticks there. If not, it doesn't matter. We have the save point. And so let's go back. Let's go back. Empty select. Oh, where is it? Uh, this one, right? Zakina. Zakina. This is the one, the magic one. The one where I was impressed with because all the planets are good too. Very good resources. And yeah, it'd be perfect for building building a spot to, for harvesting, just for harvesting resources. This is a fantastic system, so let's go on to Rython N33. Oh yeah, do we have to discoveries? Let's upload. 390 nanites, nice. Those will come in handy when I need to upgrade some of our ships. There are other ships that we have. It's, that's what's cool about this recent update, is it's a lot easier to manage your ships. I was a real pain in the butt before, but now, uh, man, I'm so glad what Hello Games is doing with the game. It's definitely headed in the right direction, and looks amazing. I'm gonna play it on the highest settings that I can set. Might have to check to see if they can go higher, but yeah, I'm just loving it, loving this game and what it is, just all of this stuff, the flying around, the, uh, this is just a big part of it, it's like Red Dead Redemption 2, you know, we've been live streaming that, or not we, uh, my brother Lushable Echo has been live streaming that, and so, what is this, what is that there, interesting, I'll we'll have to make sure, uh, well, to make sure we check that out, I think that's the, uh, the out, uh, not outpost, but the, it's like a factory. That you can get components out of it. Really cool thing. But yeah, now it's storming. Storming. Ooh. So how are we going to start building? Well, basically, how uh, should I charge my freezing thing? Uh, oh yeah, and we can have multiple... Multi-tools, that's another cool thing. It's a C though, so it's no good. It has to be A or higher. A or higher. So, oh, this is just so cool. Such a good place to build by. Okay, so what are we going to build? So, let's see here. Okay, so, first thing, first when you build anything, we're going to need to place the base computer. But I like to place these in a... 
like a location that makes sense, right? So we might just place it like right here, like in, as if it's part of this base. Yeah, I think that's what we'll do. And so. Okay, let's do that. So let's see what happens if we place it right here like this. Place. Okay, I need to... Uh, is that the direction I want it facing? Uh, maybe. 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 We'll see how it interferes. See what we're able to do. Now, some of you might be laughing and ha ah, you know, but I haven't tried to do this. And I think other people have maybe out there, but I don't cruise the internets for all of that. Not at all. No, no, no. <laughs> um, oh, man. Oh, he's working again. Oh, yay. He got fixed. Sweet. Okay. Good. <laughs> I was worried he was going to be broken. So now this is our base. Right? Okay. So now we can interact with this. Artographic. Sonar test for pseudo site. Claim site. Oh, I guess we'd have to claim base. Yeah, let's claim it. Doesn't matter if, if there's um, a power plant, like a place to generate power from or not. I forgot about that. Forgot that we need to change our visor. <laughs> so we could definitely do that. And we can change the survey mode. So what? Uh, energy. Uh, I don't think there's energy, maybe. Wow, that sucks. Hmm. Okay. Interesting. I'm just, I'm just seeing if there's a uh, power. Okay, so we'll have to survive with um, with uh, obviously solar power. I imagine we'll get that here still. Just need to come in and recover from the snow. I might pop a pack. Yeah, whatever. Let's recharge our suit. Um, don't use dioxide. I'm gonna use basically batteries. So let's use let's use this. How many batteries do you use? Three batteries. Interesting. What do we need to make batteries? I wish you could see the recipe. Cobalt and ferrite dust. How much cobalt do we have? Yeah. Okay, so that's basically 86 batteries. Yeah, we can use batteries, but we're going to use them. So we're going to have to replace that with cobalt, which is fine. That's at the other base as cobalt. At least now we can survive out here a little bit longer. Okay, so let's... I guess I can just build... I don't have to clear these out. But, I don't know. I find that fun. And I don't mind the, getting the resources. Like salt. Like, that's pretty cool. Uh, plus, we can scan minerals that we don't have dioxide that's cool salt such a weird resource for this planet okay okay so now the idea is to have a vehicle bay right so since this area is flat here I just want to see how I want to line up. Okay, so if the vehicle thing is flat. I don't know why I was looking in there. Structures. Okay, why? Is there different paving? Or is it the same? Yeah, it's the same. Okay. So let's just see what happens when we build. Okay. Now I'm just 
snapping together. This is kind of like hard or composite paving. Okay. So I don't know. Is this how we want the vehicle bay? Is this the only paving I have? Uh, I'm just going to check out. <clears throat> so we've got this stuff. So we got cylindrical square rooms, etc., etc. Right? Access ramp. Is that attached to this? Oh, okay. I'm just kind of trying to mess around. I'm a complete noob to the building system. So be just bear with me there. You have to charge a battery again. <laughs> this is going to be a pain in the butt. That's why we have to set this up. I guess we go basic, right? And then we say we go metal. Concrete, some metal. All right. And metal floor. Oh, so it does snap in. Okay. But they're different size. See, can you see that? Interesting. Interesting. So should I use floor panels instead? Okay. Now what's cool with the new update is we can get out of this. Um, we can actually, if we, we change our multi-tool to the train manipulator, you can do the middle mouse button, create, flatten, restore. Ah, oh, this is what's cool. So now, you can restore an area back to what it was before you manipulated it, which is actually epic, right? Uh, epic. You can make a big area, a small area, right? Um, so let's go back. So there's flatten, which is fine. We don't need, I don't think, right? Um, well, let's just see what happens with flatten. So this is the new feature as well, is this flattening tool. God, this is amazing. Why am I flattening? Well, why not? All right, if you're going to build in this area, why can't we flatten it? We're getting resources for it. So... Is it using power? Uh, maybe when it's... Only when you actually use it. Okay, so that's cool. So that's a good area, flatten. You probably didn't even have to. But yeah, that's pretty cool. So now what do we do? I need to recharge. <laughs> that's what I need to do. Get back to the mining beam. Let's run inside. Oh man, this is so funny. I think I'm gonna use the floor, the middle floor there to start with, just to create kind of like the inner structure where the vehicles are gonna be stored. Oh, the garage and then we'll go from there I think I think is kind of what the game plan is and then I'll probably cut the video soon keep it short and sweet type of, of deal here because I think it's good because you get the idea what the building is going to be and now it's going to be pretty boring from now on so I think what we'll do is we'll just line up line up with this okay Line up with this thing. Do that. Oh yeah, I can. Okay, okay. So this would be like a doorway. So let's see how do we middle frontage. Oh, I see. Frontage. Power door, middle doorway. Ah, uh, this is what I like. Use that. See, so yeah, so this is kind of what we'll do, right? And then, and then we're going to see. So then we can kind of create this stuff, which uses glass, of course. All right. Oh, that's gonna be so cool. So I want to create uh, like a little covered area. 
roof panel. So you can have a big roof panel. Is there a flat roof? No, okay. Doesn't count, doesn't count. <laughs> almost, almost. I think once we put the door in, uh, then we'll be able to... Oh, that's cool. Maybe we'll do the glass instead. Do the floor plan. Oh, okay, so the floor panel could be the, the metal wall, metal wall, metal arch. Yeah, okay, we're gonna use. So that's the metal roof, right? Okay, so we can create another doorway. So that way there's a little hatch, and then and then we'll go from there. So okay, so that way we have this little place here. So now do I face the inside or the outside, huh? Okay, oh, oh, nah, good. This is what we want. Okay. Do I have to actually do anything with these doorways or is this is how they are? Interesting. No, I think this is its own pod perfect okay this is what i wanted okay so now now let's go back to basic metal uh let's see here where's the floor okay. small floor oh cool so we can't use small ones okay let's so does this matter about orientation okay so let's do this 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 we're watching for the storm, right? Okay, so I need to change this up. <laughs> Let's run inside. <laughs> okay. Woo! <laughs> Small solid cube room. Cuboid room. Stacked or linked to form larger structure. Oh, interesting. So I could use the cubes instead of. Interesting. Uh, let's buy some glass. Let's buy some glass. Because I know that this guy has glass. Let's do that. Just components. Let's use glass. Right here. Might as well. Uh, they're kind of discounted. And I don't know. That's why we got the credits. We can always make more. Okay. So I need to position the... I'll show you here in a second. I need to position technology. I need to position... So we, I want one of every vehicle on every planet that we visit. So the first things first is Colossus. It, it is bigger than I expected. So means that it's kind of like this, right? Okay. I need to add more blocks. A lot more blocks. <laughs> oh, boy. Okay, large basic metal. Because we want metal for the floor here. This is the inside, right? So that's one, two... Of course, this is how we add more, right? Okay. Dang, it's hard to see in that in that storm. Can't wait to have this done, though. Holy crap! Okay, so let's go back into um, tech. There we go. Chill bay. I need five metal plating. Five metal plating. Let's make a bunch of this stuff. Um, let's make 10. Yeah, you just press and hold. And it makes more there. Okay, perfect. And I figure we're going to blow through resources. That's why we're doing it. 
because I have plenty. And why not? Almost be good to make an outpost mission, but it takes you to a particular planet, so you have to choose that. And I don't like that, so I'm just going to do it here. I'm going to continue. And I'll cut it. And well, we're about 40 minutes in based on where I have it here because in Streamlabs OBS um, there's a timer for when you're recording and that's the timer I have it on and this is all uncut so so far so good just as I would expect and um, let's let, let's try and place this Geobay now or not Geobay but whatever this, this is called Colossus Geobay I guess it's called the Geobay so I want to kind of Do this. So if that's the wall. Uh, maybe we will lead it. Uh, but the Colossus is in the way. It's okay. Whoa. Okay, so uh, rotate. Oh shoot! Ooh. 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 Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> it's kind of hard when you can't see. God, this planet's brutal, man. It's brutal. Okay, so we got the Colossus. Ah, I got a paint job on it. Be completely different. Let's drive this over here. Oh, no fall yet. There we can park it right here. Okay, it's it looks pink on this planet, but that's actually red. <laughs> it's just funny. That's too funny. I did make the jets pink though, that is correct. Okay. Geo Bay. I want it the thingy, yeah. Oh, yes, okay. Exactly where I want it. Okay, okay. So now we can <clears throat> go back to this. Sick. Just debating, like, if I should use those windows or these windows. Use these ones just because I like them. Uh, does it matter which way we're facing? I don't know. Yeah, because I want glass on this place. Let's see, I don't, I don't think it matters which way we're facing, it's as long as they snap in. Okay, so I'm not sure how this is gonna look because there's a power door right but is it not gonna let us out or do I have to treat this like an outside space so do we have to like create right so like use the arch somehow thinking here folks thinking thinking I might just call it but you get the idea I'm gonna make uh, an area here which has the geo bays, which means I need to add more, more floors. Basically, I have to add more of these ones. So I even have to go this way. That's on the base. It almost sh should flatten it to get the the dirt from the ground. How far out can we go this way? <clears throat> I think the spacing in front is good. The one block might be fine. Um, I don't know how we're going to seal this in, but I do want a geobay area, and so this is the plan, right? And then I think we'll create the rest upstairs, so the downstairs kind of like the geobay area. Let's do one more. And then upstairs would be the, um, the other stuff, right? See, that's why we gotta do some mining, or mining, um, to get rid of... 
get rid of anything that we can get rid of. Because we could use the ferrite dust. Oh, gosh. Yeah, yeah, I know. This is ferrite dust, so it helps us build the base. Uh, but yeah, okay. But you get the idea. I'm going to build Geo Bay there. Uh, let's get... Let's call it here. It's a good time. It's, it's, you have the gist, or you get the gist of it. Uh, when we come back, you'll probably see more of this done. Uh, but let's see if we can place another Geo Bay. Just to get some sizing ideas and just to see how we want this uh, organized. Back to uh, this. There we go. We got the Rover, Nomad, Pilgrim. They're all big, hey? So, Pilgrim. I think we can place this. So maybe a little bit more over. So you want to kind of have like a road area. Maybe two block road area. So let's go back to structures. Basic metal. Metal floor. So now we can go this way. Yeah. Now this could change the way we're building over here. Because it's kind of coming into the existing terrain, but to be honest, it doesn't bother me. So, anyways, you know, hopefully you've all enjoyed this episode. I have tried to keep my swearing minimal and all that wonderful fun stuff. And hopefully it shows. But thank you for, for sticking around in... Woo! <laughs> Meleeed. Thank you for... Ah, come on. Just have to let... There we go. <laughs> thank you for sticking around and and enjoying uh, you know, the episode, I hope. And let's see here. Man, these emotes and all that stuff are so... Like, I, oh, I, I guess you could quick bind, right? So if you went... So say we did... Let's do that. It's quick bind. Let's go... Control control one for this. Okay. So now how does it work? If I hit one. Ah, nice. Okay, well thank you everybody. Hopefully you've enjoyed this episode and I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye.